everyone. So I am at the uh, road that you would take to get into Troutdale. I think it's Dicky Gap or something like that. Um, still can't find <laughs> Easy and Doc. They were ahead of me this morning when we left, but I've done 16 miles and it's only 2.30 and we wanted to camp at the shelter 20 miles away. So it's in four miles. So it feels like I've done this pretty fast, but I haven't bumped into anyone. So now I think I might be ahead of them. Um, and I'm not sure how that would have happened, but I might be ahead of them. Uh, so I'm just going to go to the shelter and cook dinner and see if anyone shows up. news everyone I have found my friends turns out I passed easy and doc while they were both using the privies this morning and I had no idea um, but yeah found my friends It is just after 9 a.m. and for the first day yet on trail, I am in a t-shirt and shorts. Uh, it is finally warm for once. Um, and it's supposed to get up to 80 today. So we're at the uh, Mount Rogers Visitor Center now, which is where the road to Marion goes. Oh, there's water. I thought. <laughs> hitched down to Marion um, because there was a Taco Bell and we're all pathetic um, but we almost got out and then there was an ice cream place and again I repeat we are all pathetic so here we go we've all got our ice cream <laughs> and there is five of us hiking together right now there is Jukebox Hi. Uh, you know him there's Mr. Perfect and there's Doc Okay, so the most fun part about cool. hiking with Mr. Perfect cool. is that he's deaf, so we are all trying to learn sign language so that we can talk to him more. A um, C so, hold on. A L M N O P Q <laughs> R S No, thumb in front. S Nice. T U V W X Y Z. What's everyone's favorite word that they've learned? You like that in America? <laughs> okay, give us a word. Ugly dude. <laughs> All right, <laughs> give us a word. Bear. Give us a word. E. Uh, Boyfriend. Holy moly. America, you've never seen a hill before. Your time to take it here. Okay, ladies, we're doing great. <laughs> On me, we're gonna hit a power cycle. One, two, power cycle, move with the music, move with the music, <laughs> let's go Sasha, you in the back corner, no hottie back there. So we found this old schoolhouse, and in the corner, we got chips, and soda, and there's all this stuff. That's crazy. I love food. <laughs> look at these, look at all these ace bandages. Whoa. Were the boxes covered when you guys came in? Yeah. They were closed. Oh, wow. And I just like saw the trail volunteer sign. Oh, wow. Just went up a steep hill and as you can see, we're not really loving it all that much at all, but probably going up again.
that was a close one. <laughs> yeah. Don't like this. <laughs> That's how you say don't like. Silent. Doc, what do we have up here? Oh my god. You're my <laughs> mortal enemy. <laughs> Dogs go under. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Dog, it's like a jungle gym. <laughs> Dog, it's like a jungle gym. <laughs> I figured it out. The fastest way to get over, guys. That's how I do it too. Throw your poles. Who needs them? Who needs them? It does taste like garlic. Yeah. Mm. What are they? They're ramps. They taste like garlic. Huh. There you go, ramps. They usually grow around water sources like this. Good morning. Um, so the big issue of my life right now is that. My shoes have nearly 600 miles on them. Um, I think everyone kind of replaced their shoes either in Damascus or for some reason before Damascus. Um, and I had wanted to replace mine in Damascus, which was mile like 475 or something. But uh, out of the four outfitters, none of them had ultra chimps in my size. So they had sevens, but they didn't have six and a halfs. And the sevens just like were loose. So I need to get online when I get to Bland and order a pair of shoes and hopefully have them sent somewhere nearby because we've got a hole in the right foot. So we are at the Chestnut Knob Shelter, which is where we're having lunch, and this big gap down here, um, Gudhook says, looks down on Burke's Garden, a very fascinating geological formation, uh, which looks like a giant eight mile by four mile crater from above, formed by a limestone sinkhole. Valley only has one natural outlet in the north, and only two roads leading in and out of it. Um, so we walk around the rim of the garden for the next eight miles. It's cool. And here's the shelter, and we're gonna have lunch here. is raining outside and it was supposed to rain all weekend it's Sunday today but so far it hasn't been bad and I think it's gonna hold off and we're gonna get into Bland this afternoon and there's a Dairy Queen in Bland um, so we're all really excited to go and get Dairy Queen and I haven't stopped walking since this morning because um, we only woke up 11 miles out of town and I'm so close to getting a blizzard and I've been eating just Nutella plain um, because I don't have any snacks left. So that's making Dairy Queen so much more exciting. Right down there, 
is some kind of red light, like it's part of a gas station. And I'm pretty sure that that is bland, which means that I can practically see Dairy Queen from here. Um, I am doing the whole 11.9 .9 miles with no stops, no sitting, no breaks to get to ice cream as quickly as possible.